I'm proud to say to you that I've never been to the improv until I went to the improv in Las Vegas the first time. I see this man walk on a stage and I'm waiting to see what he does. He destroyed me. I know it's a terrible way to build up someone because they have to follow that, right? He can do it. Max Alexander. Let Here's it. ladies and gentlemen, Max Alexander, right here. Next month, would you welcome, please, Max Alexander. Max. Welcome, Max Alexander. Please welcome, Max Alexander. Good friend, Max Alexander, ladies and gentlemen. Please welcome, Max Alexander. Yeah. Doctor says I should exercise. Spent two hours at the gym today. Could not find parking. <laughs> I was exhausted. <laughs> I used to ride a bike when it was fun. Remember when bike was a, was a fun thing to do? Now it's exercise. They sucked all the fun out of it. <laughs> Gotta wear those tight biker shorts, you know, those tight lycra things. Supposed to keep your butt in. I like my butt to stick out. <laughs> I like the noise it makes in the spokes in the back wheel. <laughs> Honey, look at that Harley with pedals. What is that? <laughs> Having a big butt when you ride a bike is a safety feature. You're going down a hill, your brakes fail, you squeeze your butt together. You know who lies a lot? Fat people like me. We always lie. We always have an excuse for being fat. Ooh, I'm big boned. I don't even know if I have bones underneath this. I could be Gumby. I have no idea. Glad to be here. Uh, they put us in a hotel. I, I don't like staying in hotels. The, the maids, no matter what sign you have on the door, today she knocked on the door. Got to come in and clean up. So I let her in, she took a shower and went home. <laughs> yeah, that's okay. I played a trick on her. You know, when you go into a hotel, they have that paper band around the seat. I take it off, I use it, I put it back on. <laughs> Done this for three days. Today she left me a bowl of prunes. I'm trying to lose a little weight. It's, uh, yeah, these last 10 pounds are the hardest. <laughs> I, uh, I tried them all. I was on the Valium diet. Every morning for breakfast, you take four Valium. The rest of the day, the food keeps falling out of your mouth. They flew us out here, it was great. I'm not thrilled about flying, it's scary. As soon as you take off, they talk about dying. <laughs> Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for flying with us. In case we go into an emergency landing. <laughs> emergency landing? Going into the ocean at 600 miles an hour <laughs> is not an emergency landing. <laughs> I looked it up in a book. It was a damn crash. <laughs> it said damn in the book. <laughs> you go from 600 miles an hour to let's say zero. <laughs> in approximately ooh, no seconds. <laughs> You're part of the weather system. They give you instructions. Take all sharp objects out of your pocket. <laughs> Let's review. <laughs> You're barreling into a mountain. 
eight, nine hundred miles an hour. Yeah, 40,000 gallons worth of flammable fuel behind you. You got a number two pencil in your pocket. You're funny as hell, you know that? <laughs> Most people who come to Los Angeles who find it a little dis discomforting at first. Are you? you no, I like it out here. They have everything. They have wonderful, big and tall man shops out here. I, well, I'm tall, so I go. Yeah. 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 That's, uh, I had a problem. I bought this new suit here for the show. Very nice. Could I show this? Sure. It, I wanted to have this done. Oh, thank you. <laughs> you know they have big man designer jeans. Yeah. And uh, these are they're from the same company. And look at the. The behind they give you on these things. Yeah, what's... And this, I have no idea. <laughs> <laughs> I showed it to Wardrobe. Yeah. He said, just pick up your pants, you'll look better. I said, all right, you know, Johnny Carson, this, yeah. is, this is the top, I gotta look good. So, you know, if I just gotta look good. <laughs> <laughs> well, you kind of... Well, that's, that's a fashion statement if I've ever seen one. Yeah, you, you could house the homeless in there. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't have extra room.